Hey fellas, welcome to our channel Complex Coder. My name is Sanam and in this video we are going to learn how we can install and set up React along with Visual Studio Code. So basically what we have to do is first install Visual Studio Code. So let's download Visual Studio Code. I'll provide the link in the description, don't worry. We need system installer 64 bit. Mixing, thanks for downloading. Downloading has been started. Okay. So let's install this. Yes. I accept. Click on next, next. Of course, next add to path yes take this option this is required actually and no we don't need an extra binder okay install and along with visual studio code we need to install node.js so download node.js okay so there are two version one is lts second is current lts is you know long term support uh, current is actually a kind of beta version, so I'm going to download the LTS Windows installer, yes, and 64 bit Visual Studio Code is installed. Finish now. Let's install node. Okay, next I accept. Next, next. Okay, next. No, we don't need chocolatey. Stop. Okay, what we will be doing is we will create a React project the, by using the Create React app. So let it install first. Because in order to use Create React app, we need the npm or the npx and that comes along with the Node.js setup. Once, okay, done, finish. Okay, now open Visual Studio Code. Okay, okay. Uh, let me tell you something first. See. Uh, you can check uh, whether the node.js is installed or not by typing npm and yes the command is working okay so let me check yes it's installed okay now we have to create our first react app go to download documents and okay create a new folder say first react okay select folder okay so you can open a terminal by here new terminal or you can just do control shift tilde this key is known as the key is actually below the escape key and that is known as tilde so here let's check first npx yes it's working so npx create react app and i'm going to use dot slash uh, what we do is we type here the project folder name but we have already created the folder first react app so in order to create the files inside this folder we will be using dot slash enter npx installed and see you will see I'm creating a new react app in this particular folder okay and one more thing if somehow if you type npm here and it is giving you an error that npm is not an internal or external command 
so what we have to do is add the npm in here environmental variables here in the path like this you have to create or copy the path of the npm in the environmental variable in the path otherwise you will get an internal or external error uh, sometime it happens uh, that when you install node.js the path itself doesn't copy here so what you can do is os go to node.js and see you can copy this path and paste into here path new okay 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 and refresh your pc and your internal or external error will be gone okay along with that you can also install some extensions react snippet this one ES7 React Redux install let it complete now once you see this now once you see the happy icon then that means your app is ready so you can run it by npm start the script start Starting a development server. Let me open it side by side. Now, why uh, we have installed this ES7 React, you know, a React snippet. And the benefit of this is, for example, I want to create an app. So what I have to do is I can just type RFCE. And it will automatically import a basic template or snippet. And let's say it is hello. And you can see this is completely working. Okay, so this is how you can set up the React along with Visual Studio Code. Okay, so that's it. If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Complex Coder. Bye bye.